Glaciers in the Swiss Alps are melting faster than ever before. There are about 1,400 glaciers, but they have lost about half their total volume in the last century. The concerningly rapid pace of glacial ice melting is revealing some curious mysteries, though. High above the Swiss Alps, we're on our way to see climate change in action. The nourishing area of the glacier is now, we don't have much snow at the moment. The ice is melting at an unprecedented rate, revealing a wreckage hidden long ago. On a ledge glacier, this aircraft lost in the 1960s has re-emerged. First, I saw the wings, where you can see now here. I saw the seats over there. I saw an eyeglass case, and the Nivea cream still looking good. And I saw a wet hut and damaged objects distributed in the area. Here they found a plane. On two nearby glaciers, two bodies have been unearthed. Those lost to the ice, discovered in Switzerland's Great Thaw. The glaciers are disappearing. They say when it continues like this, in the year 2090, there will be only remaining 10% of the glacier. Switzerland's 1,400 glaciers have lost half of their total volume in less than a century. Another pressure on water supplies in a time of widespread drought. We can see the problem up here. It's for the whole Europe or for the whole world because of the water. Not only we need the water, the whole Europe needs the water from here. At nearby Glacier 3000, the consequences of climate change are also apparent. A path iced over since Roman times is now revealed. So you can see this rock I'm walking on, and until recently this was all covered in ice, but now this thin sliver between the two sections of rock is all that remains. And for the first time in more than 2,000 years, this path is going to be revealed, and that's a direct consequence of climate change. They've had little snow in the winter, a warm spring, an exceptionally hot summer, and that means they're expecting to lose more than three times the amount of ice than they usually do. These photos show how starkly glacial ice has receded. Here, say Rouge Glacier is expected to totally disappear in the next 15 years. On Rona Glacier, scientists are mapping the changes, how quickly the ice is moving, how much has melted. Here, a huge section has already collapsed. The situation for glaciers is really poor. It may well be kind of the worst year we have, we'll have on record. What's the cause and what happens if we don't stop it and save the glaciers? Well, the cause of glacier retreat is well established. That's uh, due to rising temperatures, which are linked obviously to the ongoing climate change that we have. It's not only affecting glaciers, but it's affecting also many other compartments of the Earth system. So like drought, heat waves, glacier melt, they're all connected? Absolutely. For some, it's already too late. Some glaciers will be gone in 15 years. The future of the rest depends on us. Our desire and ability to slow the global warming, heating up our world.